hello and welcome back uh, to this uh, tutorial series of the ict elective um, today i'm answering the 2025 uh, publisher the for the for the school candidate examination for publisher um, uh, if you have watched uh, my previous videos um, you will see that i have answered the excel part and i've also uh, answered the html part so in this video i'll be focusing on the microsoft publisher okay so um as you can see let's first read the, the questions uh, it says uh, using microsoft publisher a uh, design a poster as shown in figure one so we're gonna um, create something of this nature and uh, it says set the heading of the poster that is this heading um font to aerial rounded size of 36 points color red center and yellow background use font homa with 13 points for your full name and index number as you, that should be this one and then later it says set the font footer okay set the footer okay uh, to your full name and index number so i don't know why they have here the full name and index and then request also for you to put the okay so it says use clip art to insert images of four hardware components um, of a computer system and uh, label them use silver background too for the page background set all margins to 0 0.5 paper size a3 and orientation of landscape save the document as poster in both publisher and pdf formats okay this is also a simple one so let's go to um publisher so let's in publisher here um so based on the question that's why it's important to treat everything before you start doing anything it has already given us a clue on the paper size we should use which is a3 paper size with a margin of 0 0.5 okay inches so um i'll come to more paper sizes here and then i look for a3 with a landscape dimension so i'll click on a3 and then click create so now i have an a3 size paper okay so let me just uh, okay so uh, at the top we have computer systems so it says set the heading of the poster okay let's just type so that means we're gonna insert a text box we're gonna insert a text box okay we're gonna insert a text box here and then uh, we type computer system okay okay looks small but we're gonna increase it so we should increase it to size 36 with the font area round so we go to the size size 36 and then where is area round if you don't see it you type it area round okay it's here <coughs> and then we should put it at the center according to the question and the color should be red we go to color red okay and then uh, color red should be centered yes yeah, already centered and uh, the background should be yellow um so i believe that one you have to go to shape and then you go to shape fill and then yellow so the background should be yellow okay that's done so let's use font tahoma 13.5 points for your full name and index so that should be here so let's insert another text box at the bottom here mm. okay uh, the font size should be 13 so you can even type it before you can even set your uh, put your settings uh, before even you start typing 13.5 okay 13.5 
okay and then the font should be Tahoma so we search for Tahoma uh, am I typing it right oops okay mm. where is my text box um, okay let me inside the text box again Mm. Okay, thirteen, thirteen point five, and then okay, Tahoma is already set. So I've already set my font. So I will type. Uh, it says, let me see. Uh, so my full name and index number. So I will type my full name. And my index number so let's say my index is a zero two and zero okay something like that all right so it as you can see when you highlight you can confirm you see it's 13.5 and then the font is the home uh, so here yeah, it didn't say you should center it will leave it like that so it says set the footer with your full name mm, mm, index number looks similar but uh where we put this and the footer is different so if you want to insert the footer uh, you either go to the master page or you can just come to insert and say footer so this will take you to the footer so once you see this background a yellowish background know that you are in the master page so in the master page let's go back to the correction it says uh, set the footer to your full name mm, okay so my full name and my index number hmm. the footer now has my full name and my index number so i'll click close so as you can see you have your full name and your index number okay here all right so let's go back so i don't know it is centered here uh, the full name and the index number is centered here uh so maybe let's just center it also even though the question did not say we should center it but when you look at the the diagram there so maybe we can just i don't think that will be harmful all right so we move to the next question the next question says use clip art to insert images of any four hardware components of uh, a computer system now uh, unfortunately um, newer versions of microsoft office in general does not have clip art okay so that's uh, probably an oversight from the examiners um, because i think uh, clip art ends uh, in microsoft office 2010 and a lot of people now are using either 2013 20, 2016 2019 2021 so clip art is no more available so uh, if something like this uh, happens um, yeah the invigilator or the uh, the technician uh, during the examination should be notified so that they will write it as a report okay so that um, it can be considered so in my case here i don't have a clip art so during the exam i advise my students to use a uh, clip um, shapes you know to use shapes because there were no images there were no clip art at the computer so in my case here just for the purpose of uh, this tutorial i will be using um, some images so i will insert a uh, keyboard and I will go back and insert uh, a mouse, okay. And then insert the printer. Mm. Anyway, if but, but if at all your computer is also connected to the internet, you'll be able to have access to images online but otherwise um, if there are no images you can just use shapes 
okay so that must be an oversight from the examiner so let's arrange these um, images okay mm, or maybe we can just place them like this So we can use, uh, for example, a text box to label them. So what you're going to do, you can go to insert, you go to text box, you can draw a text box, for example, and then call this a mouse. Okay, you can increase the font, increase the font, uh, put it in the center. Okay, so once you have that, you can now duplicate uh, Control C, Control V to copy and paste, and then place them there. Okay, do the same thing, Control V again. Mm, okay, so as you can see, the smart guides are assisting you so that you can align things properly. So I'll change this name to printer change this one to processor okay and then uh, okay let me crop this a little bit let me crop this okay this would be too much All right. So I'll call paste, and then call this keyboard. All right. So let me just place that one around here. Okay. Not bad. Okay. So let's go back and check um so it says use silver background too for the page background so let's go to page design so we have the background here we have the solid gradient uh, so silver too is not here but we can use any of these silver colors okay any of these silver colors and uh, we go back and check set all margins so let's confirm the page margins so on page design we go to page margins so as you can see the page margins are already set to 0 0.5 both uh, for the top left bottom and right but just in case they are not set you go to custom and then you set them here okay yes and then we have uh, okay save the document as poster in both publisher and pdf so we go to file save as browse we go to our folder on the desktop um, we call this poster so as you can see it's going to be saved as a publisher file then after doing that we go back save as and then we save it now we change the save as type to pdf and then we click save okay perfect perfect so now when you go to the folder when you go to your folder you should now see that you have two of them a publisher file and a pdf all right so i believe uh, that answered the question um for that was ict elective exam question um thanks for watching and uh, you know don't don't forget to subscribe to support this channel bye for now